All right, folks, welcome back. We're doing our stop motion photography follow along where I'm gonna walk you through the steps to create our disappearing nachos animation. Now, what I'm going to do is just show you a few steps at a time, then I'm gonna put instructions on the screen. When you see the on-screen instructions, just pause the video, do the steps, and when you're done, replay the video for the next set of steps. So here we go. First things first, we're going to go to Animate CC. I'm going to do File, New. I'm gonna select HTML5 Canvas and we'll set the width to be 800 and the height to be 800. I'm going to hit OK. And then we're going to resize this stage by doing Fit in Window. Next, we're going to save our file by doing File, Save, and what you're going to do is select wherever your Animate CC for Every One folder is, go into the Nachos folder, and we're just going to call this Carl Nachos. And you can put your name there instead of Carl, obviously. We're gonna hit Save. Next, we're going to import our photos. So we're gonna go to File, Import, and we wanna select Import to stage. We're going to navigate to the Animate CC for Everyone folder. You're going to select the Nachos folder, go into Photos Small, and it's important now that you select the image with underscore 7611. That's the first image in the chronological series of images, and you're going to hit Open. You'll then see this message that says, this file appears to be part of a sequence of images. Do you want to import all the images in this sequence? And you're going to hit yes. Good job. Now you'll notice that we have all of these images imported as keyframes. Now they start with no nachos. And as I slide forwards, we go to more nachos and more cheese. We want to reverse this sequence. So what you're going to do is click and hold your mouse down and drag to frame 10. That's going to select all of those frames. They should all be highlighted now. I'm gonna click off and one more time just to show you, you click, hold the mouse button down and drag to select all the frames. With the frames selected, you're going to right click and choose Reverse Frames. Drag the playhead back and then hit Return to watch your nachos disappear. To add more time to each frame so we can see it on screen longer, we're going to add more frames in between each keyframe. I'm going to hit F5 one, two, three, four, five times. I'm going to select the next keyframe and hit F5, one, two, three, four, five, and do that for all the keyframes, including the last one. When you're done, your animation should be 60 frames long. And you can now go back to frame number one, hit return or enter to play, and now you can watch your animation. Do a final file, save, and congratulations, you're all done. Did you yell woohoo? I don't think I heard a woohoo. Come on, woohoo, you did it. You made an animation, it's awesome. And next I'm gonna show you how to share it with your friends. It's the best.